Hello and welcome back to Dungeon Crawl Stone Soup. And this is Larry, the uh, eclecticist. Gargoyle of Chabriados. Gargoyle, fighter, mage. A little bit of everything here. So, eclecticist is a fitting title. Anyway, um, yeah, this is episode 10 already. So I've got a feeling it's, um, this is going to be a fairly long series, unless we die, of course. Um, but my goal is indeed the extended endgame. Once you get a taste for that, you just three runes is just not enough. You know? <laughs> mm. So we will continue here with the waltz. Um, blah, blah, blah. Yes, let's read. <clears throat> Try to remember what we have uh, of spells. Yeah, we need some cure mutation here. Um, <clears throat> the bad mutations are, of course, bad. Not sure about this using MP to strengthen wands, but eh. doesn't sound too good. Um, and this one's spells are easier to cast, less powerful, uh, not really good. Uh, I guess it depends on how you look at it, but I don't like it. This one, passive map, small area, is useful. Spit poison, eh, I don't know, sharp two nails, clumsy, eh. Well, clumsy is just straight up and bad, of course. Death Knight. Okay. So. Uh, oh, it's the crypt. Yeah, so as I. Hmm, glowing Buckler. That's. Uh, Nice! Ooh, that's excellent. <clears throat> I mean, it's just a buckler, but still plus two and has the reflection brand. Um, <clears throat> not sure what affects how well you reflect. It reflects blocked things, so that might be. Uh, is it based on the shield? Value or shield skill, or both, probably. I'm not sure, to be honest. Ugh, eat this fruit. And acquirement, wow. Okay, this is a <laughs> good start. Um, so, what are we gonna acquire? Still use a good cloak, good boots. Mm. <clears throat> or an artifact buck buckler with some cool stuff. Um, jewelry. Uh, you oh. We have a reasonably good selection here. at items we do not know. I'm not sure how it weights how, it, how acquirement weighs various rings and amulets. If you get an artifact um, I do know that heal wounds and haste no we probably will not get hasting because of Chibriados. I think there's a good chance we could get a wand of heal wounds that has an high <clears throat> a high probability of being generated when you or if you acquire uh, uh, 
ones, dude. He could try for a book. This one would be nice. Grand Grimoire and Necronomicon has good stuff. Um, so I'm, I don't know, I... So, after a quick look at the source code, just to <clears throat> try to get an idea here of what's happening. Um, yeah, my assumption about wands is that was correct. Um, unknown wands will have a really high weight or likelihood. Heal wounds should be the most likely. Hasting will not happen because our god doesn't like hasting. So that could be useful. Jewelry seem to be fairly random. Um, it's like 1600 lines of code so it's uh, <laughs> difficult to quickly gauge what exactly is going on. Um, But anyway, uh, and books should give us a. Well, it can, can give us a manual. Um, it can give a random artifact book on a theme of some sort. Um, I, once again, armor just seems like the safest and hopefully most useful choice. If we go for a weapon, um, most likely we'll get something in Mace and Flails, because it usually picks from the one with the highest skill. Um, if we get a random artifact book, it seems to try to choose spells from the schools with the highest skill again, so translocations, hexes, um, something like that, conjurations. Mm. Um, <clears throat> as for armor, it seems that's just reading the comments in the source code that it just chooses a random slot random armor slot that you can use you know um, so we could just save the scroll and and uh, see if we need it later um, could of course acquire money, which would give us a couple of thousand gold at least, and we could buy all the books we want. Hmm. I'll um, I'll just hang on to the scroll for a little bit since um My voice really isn't too good today. Um, but yeah, since item destruction is no more, um, there's no need to to use the scroll of acquirement very soon or right away. So this is kind of the old school way. Oh, hello. Ah, oh, we're, yeah, we're reflecting stuff. Nice. You reflect, reflect, reflect. Nice, nice, nice. <laughs> Ow, silver. Hmm. 
Hey, and there's level 22. Oh, maybe it's finally cure mutation. Nope. But invisibility. Well, we have the spell, so. <coughs> it's not that important for us. Ooh, okay. <coughs> what do we do here? Okay, that's a lot of stuff. Let's uh, get some lightning bolt here. Maybe some face shift. Probably summoned this brimstone fiend. You can hell fire and torment, so that's a bit nasty. Oh, and a hellion. To the lich or yeah probably uh... yeah it's gotta be okay um... hellfire will hurt um, torment not as bad with this character but still, um, 29 damage. That lich is invisible. Well, you didn't say torment. Your, your, okay, you know, it did. <coughs> it did. Your body is racked with pain. Um, the torment was about 20% um, damage, 20% of my full hit points ish. So instead of the normal 50, that's good. Um, Hellion went down quickly. Let's try a slouch. Okay. Yeah, we got the Lich. Now...
is shift. What else do we have? We have regen. Looks like a good idea. Oops. Yeah. Still taking quite a bit of damage. Maybe I should use stone skin, shroud of Glubria, and that stuff a bit more liberally. Anywho, Long blades or oh, it would be nice to be able to kind of choose a the, the path we want to take um, in spell casting. You know what kind of level nine spell to go for because um, we technically we can get singularity which is really cool um, we have the book of annihilations here the glaciate and firestorm and crystal spear uh, let's put some more points into conjurations. <clears throat> That'll help help with uh, a lot of stuff, even firestorm if we go that way. And currently, it will help with our um, lightning bolts. So. Doubt. Well, you never know. Uh, let's just ignore it for now. We might use the brand weapon scroll at some point. Mm. Well, it would. Mm. So hard to say if we should commit to long blades or maces and flails. <sighs> right now the scimitar is our best weapon, but Okay, well, that's it for Waltz 3. Um, eat something and go down.
Hmm. Embroidered boots. <coughs> I think it's a good chance they are better than our boots of flying, which are quite useless. Okay, plus one. Yeah. <coughs> so these are basically plus zero boots. Um, because we can already fly as much as we want to. Oh. Oh, we have no cold resistance now. Uh, let's see, regeneration, phase shift, um, shroud of Galubria. Oh, dude. Who did that? The Etten. Oh. Okay, um, <clears throat> Blink should help. Yes, now we... Uh, heal some wounds. Um, this requires some heavy measures. Um, what do we do? <sighs> we could blink. We could blink, then use fog and run away. We could blink here, maybe. Fog, run away. We have this guy though, he can shoot us with all these bolts if we are. Could blink down here, but we don't know what's down there. Uh, 18 hit points. There's of course the panic button step from time from Che Briados. be the safest but hmm. well blinking 
it's guaranteed to work. Stop from time has a 12% failure. <sighs> Teleport takes too long. try to we can blink here hope we're not <laughs> shot or hope that it's a bolt of fire so we have super resistance um, and then use step from time when we are here and hope they just wander off in the other <laughs> directions uh, Twenty-five hit points when we drank heal wounds. If I drink another one, I'll get up to about forty, forty-five hit points, maybe. Could be enough to survive one more hit. Uh, and we regenerate. We have repel missiles. No, let's blink away. Let's let's blink. Yes. There. Okay, still alive. Can of course, just blink once more. So, right now, this guy is the biggest threat. A scroll of fog <clears throat> and try to run away or snail away, creep away. <laughs> fog should work. Fog might seem like a stupid spell, but it's quite excellent in situations like this. Of course, this guy is following. a bit extreme to do step from time here or no we need to get away uh, let's do a step from time uh. <laughs> okay so these elves have wandered into here this guy's pain and smiting and crap and it's just a conjurer if you blink here now might get out of sight of these two. They haven't seen us after we stepped back from beyond the time. <laughs> um, cannot see invisible. Cannot see invisible. Cannot see invisible. Let's quaff a potion of invisibility. Try to just I should go towards the stairs. Since we have the spell, there's no waste in using a potion of invisibility. Um Let's go here. Ooh, holy Lord. Okay, that was close. <clears throat> I probably didn't play correctly, or I'm not sure what happened down in the. Oh, was that Etten and 
the uh, Conwalker, I think, who makes other dudes mighty and uh, yeah, the Conwalker makes you can might other. Okay, so huh, maybe we should rethink our strategy here. <clears throat> well, it's not that we cannot take out an elf or two. Um. <laughs> you know? Um. It's more how we do it. Ooh, a shop. Utet's general store. Mm. Ooh, that helmet of sea invisible. Well, we would lose one fire resistance. But we don't have to swap in the ring if we just have a helmet of Sea Invisible. That's pretty useful. We can use this ring if we really need more fire resistance. Um, it's plus two, so that's one more armor class. Um, yeah. Leave this one behind. Only 250 gold, we can afford that. Yes. <laughs> we're so stealthy as well. Well, we're only fairly stealthy, but it's enough to just walk right past some dudes Ah, oh, war axe of distortion. Okay, shit. <clears throat> He's shooting frost bolts. Okay, um, hmm. and we're teleporting. So. It's the power of the regen. We should probably. Oops.
Nice to get it higher. High level. Hmm. Can we identify the book? It's the Akashic or Akashic Akashic record. Nice. We don't have to spend money on that. Now control the blink. This junction I think is good. Singularity is cool. At least what I've seen of it on video. So we need uh, translocations up, I guess. <clears throat> okay, well, that gives us something to think about for the future. enchant our fire dragon armor. Seems like a good idea. Once more. Can go up to plus eight. Okay, so we have done waltz level three and four. That's good. Some <laughs> dramatic moments there, but we survived. That's the most important thing, of course. We got a helmet of sea invisible, and we got the Akashic record, which is. <clears throat> That gives us something to to um, think about for the future. We also got ourselves a scroll of acquirement that we haven't used, and what else? The buckler of reflection. Yeah, that's good. Uh, I don't need this probably. So. future I think we can now probably commit to some translocations um, 
high level of translocations to get those cool spells and and but we need more than that maybe well, earth is sort of obvious shatter or Oh, we have a shatter. Yeah, we do. And and tornado here. Yeah. And of course, firestorm or glaciate is also cool. Uh, but I'm repeating myself. Yeah, um, but I'm gonna have to end this video right here, and um, I'll think about what to do, what to do next before the next video. I can barely talk today, dude. Anyway, um, yeah, that's it. So thank you for watching, and um, goodbye for now.